We just want to know what it's like to see your life up on screen and you know what it was like. I know it's a long project in your respect. Yeah, it's weird. I mean, it's kind of weird to see your life, you know, because we didn't really think our lives was all that. No. Just, <laughs> our, our lives to us were like black and white, yeah. and the movie is full HD yeah, color, yeah, yeah. you know, like 6K it. color, you know. So <laughs> it's just, it's weird, you know, yeah. looking at yourself, looking at the character. I'm like, was yeah. I really like that? Yeah, what, what do you and think? The, and the character was pretty close. Yeah, what do you think? Neil Brown Jr., he did a good job. Good great job. job. Yeah. All of them did great job. Even Cube's son, everybody yeah. did a great job. I mean, they they were no name actors, but yeah. their acting skills was yeah. great. And Neil Brown Jr. is a bit of a joker in the group. Are you a bit of a joker? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> the scene that got to me, I loved it. I saw, I saw it about two weeks ago. Mm -hmm. but, um, the scene that kind of hit me hard was the one where they throw you on the police, kind of throw you on the ground outside yeah. the studio. Oh yeah, in front of the studio. But is yeah. that? I want to know like how accurate that actually was. I mean, that happened a few uh, times. It may not happen exactly like that, but it has happened in front of the studio. Because we was in a place called Torrance, you know, it's white only. Yeah. You know, we here in the studio. But it happened. It didn't happen exactly, but it did happen a few times. Jeez. They had. Oh yeah. And um, like. I suppose your music in the 1980s and early 90s mm -hmm. kind of put the spotlight on police brutality a bit. Yeah. And now, like, you know, it changed a bit. But what do you think? Do you think it has changed or do you think that. I was just thinking myself. I think that, it's yeah. the same. Yeah, because it's just. NWA, you can see it now. I, I was thinking earlier, I was thinking NWA kind of put the spotlight on police brutality in the 80s. But yeah. then this this kind of recent, it's in recent times, it's social media that's putting the that's spotlight on. That's what it on. is. Yeah. yeah. And we so just, you think the changed. movie having to come out at the right time. It, yeah. You know, it's a bad time, but it, yeah. it's the right time. It's talking about the same thing 26 years ago. It's the same thing over and over. It's not just in Compton, it's all over the world. Yeah. All it's, over yeah, the world. Yeah, it is. Um, so and it's not guys, all the cops. There's always just a few. There's always a few knuckleheads and everything. Yeah. Even in a little club or something, there's always a couple. Always. So, like, what do you think of uh, I love Kendrick Lamar myself? What do you think of him, like, still talking about it? What do you think of that kind of... I mean, the, Kendrick is cool. It's yeah, great, you know. Good, yeah. I mean, I like the old school band, but Kendrick is, is yeah. pretty good. Yeah, he's, he's cool. different from everybody, you know. Yeah, that's true. His own style, so... That's how you gotta be. That's how we was, if you think about it. Yeah. Back in our days, Every group, Run DMC, everybody had their own style. Mm -hmm. Nobody sound the same. Yeah. Nowadays, a lot of people sound the same. Mm -hmm. so Kendrick like stepped away from it. Yeah. Um, I know you had a long relationship with Dr. Dre. Yeah. And it started before any bit away. Oh yeah. So what's how did how did that re like relationship develop at the start? Uh, we was DJs. You were both DJs. Both. And both kind of in a group called like World Class Wrecking Crew, and yeah. we were both DJs for. I would say a few years yeah. before yeah. NWA was even thought of. Okay. Oh, yeah. And um, I read actually recently um, that your relationship, Jerry Howard said, I think that was kind of like a, like an almost he couldn't put his finger out the relationship he had, the way you were producing. It was so like you didn't even make to speak to each other. It just yeah, worked. that's how it was. We, we yeah. clicked. Yeah. You know, just like on the football field, you know, you know the timing, yeah. and that's how we was. And how are you, are you guys today still talking? Oh, yeah. Like, oh, yeah. 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 And all of Ice Cube and yeah, we know. just me and Cube and Rand just did shows at the Ride Fest really? just a couple of weeks ago. Fifty thousand people. So, <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. Um, okay, I better finish up. But in terms of tonight, what are we to expect? And I'm gonna ask a question that we're all gonna ask. Um, are you, we gonna hear a few classics? Classic, all classics. I'm all old. Classics. I like the old school. So you straight please, the old credit. school West Coast. Great. So I'm really happy. Thank you so much for coming. Oh, Thank no you so much for doing the interview as well. No so problem. that's it for me. We be yes. here. <laughs> I'm coming straight out of Compton. 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 Compton.